Hey guys, welcome back to another Roblox video. Today we're going to be going over a few tips and tricks that can make you a better jailbreak player. So the first one is pickpocketing a key card from a cop. So what a lot of people do is they do like this, where they just stand there and they try to pickpocket them. So a lot of the times that's not the greatest thing to do. So you want to sort of like walk around them and follow their movements like this. See, boom, I have a key card. He doesn't know I'm guilty. See, he's not even following me. So that's how you um, that's how you can get key cards better. So you sort of want to like follow their movements, and then go for it. Okay, so I escaped the prison with a key card using that method. It's a great way to get a key card. Most people don't really like. So most people don't really do that way. They just like press E and just call it a day. But that's not the greatest thing because you can usually get caught. So I'm going to open this case real quick. Okay. So we've gotten a key card. And then the next tip I'm going to show you is actually a very easy one to do. But it involves the jewelry store. So I'm going to go check if it's open yet. If it's not, then I'll show you um, something else. Okay, let's go in through here. Okay. Okay, it looks like the jewelry store should open anytime now. So I'm gonna just chill out. First, I'm gonna go get some. Just get my texture. Boom. Yeah, my car's pretty flashy right now. Sort of like it though. Everybody knows where I am. It's probably not a very strategic thing to do, but you know, it's fun. That guy just went flying. Hold up, can we bully his car a little bit more? Ooh. Ooh. This is great. Okay, there's a cop here. Hold up. Okay, so I'm gonna just open this real quick. Okay, so there, we started a jewelry store robbery. We're in the jewelry store, and I'm just going to hit this until we have our 5,000 cash. Okay. Going to get this case. Going to get this case. I'm going to hit this one, too, and then just follow up on these. So we have our 5,000 cash, and then we're going to go through the lasers. So these, like, cameras, I guess, are probably the hardest part, to be honest. You know, the smaller cameras aren't too hard. You just avoid the red. But then these are, like, the two that most people die on. So what I like to do is I let this one flow all the way over there, then come back here. Arch around. Sorry, arc is the word? Yeah. So then let this one go all the way over there. Go through here. And usually you might take a damage, but one damage isn't going to hurt you, really. And then you're just going to click this, and then this one is pretty easy to complete. You can just go through this, go through this, go through this, and then that's pretty easy. And for these, just wait until they're like, the opposite, and then just sprint through. Oops. Okay, so now that we're here, I'm going to show you probably the most important thing you want to do during a jewelry store robbery. A lot of people like camping the top. I don't know why, but they just do. So crouch, like, on this, and then press space so they can sort of see through and I don't see anybody and then another trick is you go through the center door um, and then you go back into the jewelry store I think what it is is it's that when it like sees that you've already gotten out of the jewelry store and then when you re-enter it spits you out because you can't like rob something after it's already been robbed I don't know what mechanism mechanism it is but it works so I'm not gonna complain so there we go, 5,000 cash, that's pretty easy. Then we're gonna hit the bank next. So, I'm just gonna customize my car. <laughs> I got like the super lime texture going on, it's really flashy. Okay, so, to the bank. Okay, are there any cops? Okay, there is a cop in fact, but it looks like he's already been shot down, so I'm gonna stay here just chill a little bit okay so this next tip 
Um, I don't know if it's like the best one. A lot of people don't do it, but one thing that you want to do is when like the big stores aren't open yet, remember about the small stores because these things are great if you want to rob them because it's not like a ginormous amount of cash, but it's really good because, you know, you can just get a little bit of petty cash here and there, you know, and extra cash isn't going to hurt you. So this is just a nice way to get some more cash if you don't have any. And, like, you barely get busted in these. Okay, so it looks like there's a cop here. I'm gonna shoot him down real quick. Okay, he's in a heli. I'm gonna let him leave. So, I'm gonna just rob the donut store real quick. He's right in the area, so I think he's gonna try to get me. So, I'm gonna just chill out until he leaves. Okay. You know what, let's shoot him down anyways. Whoops, I forgot to reorder my hotbar. Okay, there we go. Okay, he just jumped out. Let's go get him. Wait, where did he go? Did he go into the donut store? Oh, okay, he did go into the donut store. So, you know what? Okay, let's take him out here. This next one is called the spam trick. You just spam one and two if that's, like, where your guns are. And this is just a good way to sort of... This is just a good way to get cops really quickly, as you can see. So that is another tip that can make you a much better player. Okay, I'm gonna rob this real quick. Press E, and then we're going to escape. Okay, so... I think the jewelry store... Sorry, I think the bank might be open soon. So I'm gonna just grab my Bugatti and just race there real quick. Okay. Okay. Press E and we are off to the bank. Well, this blue guy is pretty fast. I like the jet rims a lot. Okay, so through here, over this ridge, and then we're gonna go hit the bank real quick. Oh, the bank is in fact just about to open. Okay, so this guy. I don't know what he's going to do, but I'm going to go through here. Get to the bank real quick. Shoot him down real quick. There. He's done. We're going to go through here. And boom, we just started a robbery. So, I'm going to go under here and do this obby. So, the bank lasers are actually pretty simple, so I just jump through, jump through, jump through. What a lot of people do with this section is they try to, like, crouch. I recommend using that strategy if you're on, like, low health, but if you're just coming in, just walk through it, and you're still on green health. So, like, that's that's the way I do the bank obby, and I feel like it saves you more time. It's going to save you a lot more energy, I guess, and it's going to make it so that you, um, you rob the bank successfully more. Okay, so the vault is just about to open, and I got that cop down real quick. So, yeah, let's make some cash. Okay, so it's about to explode, it's exploded, and then I'm just gonna sort of, yeah, get my cash. So, um, one thing to watch out for is what a lot of people do is they, like, open this door, and then they rob this, and that's great if you only have the 1,000 bag, but if you do have the 3,000 bag, that door, in fact, closes, so you're sort of wasting time. I recommend if you have a key card, you just go through the thing, just go through the normal door. It's gonna save you a lot of hassle. Okay, so, I'm almost at 3,000, and it looks like there are no cops in the building yet. I'm just gonna pray that none come in, because I really want this cash. Okay. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. Okay, we have 3,000 cash. Gonna do this obby real quick. Just walk through it. Okay, I took a little bit of damage there, but that's okay. I'm gonna go through here. And, um, I'm gonna go through this door. Boom, 3,000 cash, and then I'm going to go head over to the um, jewelry store, because I guess that's sort of the next in the rotation, so. Okay, so that ATV is blocking my way. I'm going to come around here, and then we're going to just chill out at the jewelry store. It looks like, okay, the jewelry store is already being robbed, so then I'm going to go try to get the gas station real quick, because 
Remember, always focus on the small stores when the big stores are being robbed. Okay, over this, and then we're gonna be on our way to the gas station, I guess. Okay, so. Straight through here. Whoops. I'm gonna circle around here. Okay, so this next tip is that when you're robbing, um, like, the gas station or something, get behind the counter and get your guns out so that if people come in, you can see them. So if they come in this way, you escape that way. If they come in that way, you escape this way. It's an easy way to make sure that you don't get arrested as much. Okay. So I got that 500 cash. And I'm going to go grab, quick my, <laughs> grab my Bugatti real quick. And then we're going to go back to the city and just wait for the bank to open again. So then another thing, I guess is that, you know, a lot of the times when you're in the obbies, you can, when you're sort of like robbing, you can get pretty low on health. Um, so I recommend having a donut on hand at all times, because this is great. You'll like never die in the, jewelry, in the jewelry store again if you have the donut. Okay, so it looks like the jewelry store has been robbed. We're going to go check if the bank is open. So, well, the bank isn't open, but we're just going to wait for it to open, I guess. Okay, so let's chill out. Are there any cops? Yes, there are indeed some cops. Let's sort of bait them. Here, come on. Come on out, cops. Okay, let's let's shoot down this cop real quick. Okay, they're both in that car. Okay. I'm not going to bother, but when they come back, I'm going to shoot them down. If they come back. Okay, so get back in the Bugatti. Um... Always stay in your vehicle, I guess, when you're waiting for the stores. That way you have more mobility and you can make a quick getaway. Okay, so... Um, let's see. Are they coming this way? Okay, it looks like this is a cop. Take him down using the spam trick. Okay, he's done. Okay, this cop is here. Yo, let's try to bait him. Okay, come on out, cop. Come on out. Okay, wait, let's get out of a car. We can just chill here. Okay, come on out, cop. Okay, I'm gonna ram him. Wow. That sent him flying. Well, not exactly, but yeah. Okay, hold up. Come on out, cop. Let's try to bait him. Okay, there we go. He's out. We can take him down from here. Why did he get in the unupgraded car? That is weird. He left his, like, upgraded car and just got into the unupgraded car. That's, um, interesting. Police logic. Okay. Okay, hold up. Let's take this guy out. Okay, this guy's done. Okay, what about this guy? Jump around, just keep shooting. Okay, we've got a distance on him, let's try to take him down. Just keep jumping around, and you can take him down. Boom. They're low. Hold up, we can finish him. Let's take him out. Boom, he's done. Okay, so, we took that cop out. And then, let's see th if this cop is still there. You know, actually, I'm gonna check the bank, actually. Okay, it does look like the bank is not open yet, but it should open any time now. So, I'm gonna go check if there are any cops. Okay, it looks like there is a cop right here. Okay, come on. Come here, cop. Okay, let's bait him. It looks like he doesn't want to arrest me. That's odd. He just doesn't want to get out of his car. Okay, boom, the bank is open. I'm going to go rob this real quick. Straight through the vent, I guess, the vault. And then I'm gonna just do this obby real quick. So again, you just jump over the lasers, walk th straight through, still on green health. 
easiest way to do the obby hands down. So then, the dynamite is being placed and it should open anytime soon. Okay. Come on, open sesame. Okay, there we go. Straight through here. Let's get our money. So, I've heard that punching it makes you get your money faster. I don't think it does. I really don't think it does. Okay. So, let's check our bounty. It looks like we have a bounty of 3,200. Okay, so, it, okay, I'm just going to reload this real quick. I think the cop is going to come through here. I don't know which cop it is. Okay, yeah. Straight through there. Boom. Done. Easy. Okay, so, looks like that cop wasn't really much of a danger to me, I guess. He didn't arrest me, so let's just wait. Okay, 25, 26. Okay, the police have entered the building again. Let's wait for them to come through here. Okay, I don't see them. Are they going to camp? Come on through, cop. Okay, you know what? I'm going to reload. Oh, it's this cop. Okay. No big deal. Okay, I'm going to wait for him to come through again. Okay, come on, cop. Okay, he's done. I have my 3,000. Let's just go through here. Whoops. You know, I'm going to show you the crouching way. You just crouch and then go through. But that takes a lot longer. Okay, so we can go straight through. Um, I'm going to go through this door, and then we'll have our 3,000 cash. Okay, so boom. We got that cash, and then let's check if the jewelry store is open yet. I don't think it is, but it could be. Okay, it's been robbed again, just my luck. Oh well, okay, let's go check the small stores. So I'm gonna check for the can, um, gas station real quick, since that's the closest. Yeah. That cop's not coming back for me, which means I can probably rob this without him getting me. So, again, guns out, and then you rob. Okay. Almost there. Boom. Uh, he doesn't have any money. Okay, so, let's go check the donut shop. So, we're just gonna go through here. I wonder if the donut shop is, has any money. I think it should. Okay. So our bounty is 4,400 already. That's a pretty handsome bounty. Okay, so. Um, I don't see anybody near this donut shop. I'm going to rob it real quick. Why is one door already open? This is sort of odd. Is there somebody in there? There's nobody keeping the door open. Put the guns out. I'm gonna make sure. Okay, there's nobody. I'm gonna rob Bad CC real quick. Okay, let's see. I hope he has 500 cash. Okay, there. Oh, no cash. Okay. Bad luck, but I'm gonna check if the gliders. I'm gonna get a glider real quick because these are good for like, I guess, gliding away from cops when they're near you. I'm gonna switch that with my key card. Okay, so back in the car, and then we're gonna go wait for the jewelry store to open. I guess the bank is gonna open earlier, but because they were robbed in such quick succession, if I go to the bank, I'm not gonna be able to rob the jewelry store, and the jewelry store has 5,000 cash, and that's a little bit better than the bank, so I'm gonna go check for the jewelry store. Okay. Into the dome, interesting. So, I'm gonna circle around this, and then we'll be just about there to the jewelry store. And the jewelry store should open anytime now. Okay, there are a few cops here though. Ooh, 
Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna take this cop down. Hold up. Okay, is he gonna get out to try to get me? Um. He's not coming out, so. Um. Yeah, he's not gonna. It doesn't seem like he's gonna come out. Let's try to shoot him down, I guess. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're gonna take him down directly. Okay, come out. Okay, we can take him down. Okay, once he gets on Red Hulk, I'm just gonna finish him off. Okay, thank god he didn't arrest me. Oh jeez, he did taser me. Okay, so, let's take out this guy. Wait, is that a criminal or a cop? Okay, that's the criminal, I think. So, I'm just gonna grab this. Well, I'm just gonna chill out here until the rooster opens, I guess. Okay, is he gonna get out? He is gonna get out, so I'm gonna take him down real quick. Come out. Come on out. Okay, there we go. Finally got him. And then the drawer store should open soon. I don't know why it's taking so long to open. Supposedly you can rob it and then you have to only wait five minutes. I feel like it's been five minutes, but I don't know. Okay, I'll unlock it, I guess. Do you want to get in? Oh, crap. Okay, should we take him down? Yeah, I'm gonna take him down, so... Oh, he's in the hell. Oh, he's gonna camp, isn't he? Okay. That's cool. Okay, he got out- well... The person shot him down. Let's try to get him. Okay, you know what? I don't think he's much of a threat. The jewelry store is open. I'm gonna rob this real quick. Boom, I started the robbery. Let's get 5,000 cash. Get that. Get that. Smash this one. Gonna break this one too. And then just get those two and we'll have 5,000 cash. Oops, I took a little bit of damage. I'm just gonna, you know, I don't really need my donut. But I'm gonna show you what happens. Like if you, if you like get damage and you need a donut, it can really help. Yeah, see I'm, I'm on like yellow health. Let's take one damage. Okay, that won't damage me for some reason. Okay, well, I'll probably need one once I get there since I usually take damage on this one. Okay, boom, no damage. Actually, that was a pretty nice robbery. So it looks like it doesn't, I don't really need my donut. Yeah, I'm gonna go through here. Whoops, okay, actually, I didn't get hit. And then I'm just going to do this trick. So let's see, are there any cops? No cops. Boom, straight through here. Back out here, it spits you out straight to my car, and then 5,000 cash. Easy peasy. I'm gonna check my bounty. Okay, I have a 4,800 bounty. If I do this, I think I'll have a. Uh, wait, okay. I have a 5,600 bounty. Let's push for that 6k bounty. You know what? Actually, okay. I think if we rob the um, if we rob the bank one more time, we can get a 6k bounty. Okay, let's head directly towards the bank. The bank, okay, the bank is going to open any time now. I know that for a fact. Oh, that person just robbed the bank, so I probably can't rob it anytime soon. Well then, you know what? I guess that's the end of this video. Bye guys. I hope you guys enjoyed.